spring's grape harvest is off to its earliest start in a decade due to soaring temperatures and months of drought. Yeah, that's causing a bit of a drop in production, but wine experts say it's not all sour grapes. CBS 4's Terry Okita reports from London. A summer heat wave forecasters have nicknamed Lucifer is bearing down on Italy and bedeviling grape farmers. They've jump started this year's harvest an average of 10 days early, and production is taking a hit. This spokesman from Italy's agriculture lobby says the high temperatures have created a drastic decline in production of about 10 to 15 percent. Violent hailstorms and spring frosts also hurt some of the grapes. Italy's annual wine harvest is the biggest in the world, and the industry employs about one and a half million people. But despite the heat wave, winemakers still see the glass as half full. The quantity may not be there, they say, but it could still be a very good year in terms of quality. That's because excessive heat has prevented fungus and disease from spreading on the vines. And some Italian towns had occasional rain before the hot weather, leading to more concentrated sugar levels in the grapes. The technology they have now for winemaking and cooling down grapes when they make wine and things like that, it's, it's a lot easier to um, manipulate. Last year, Italy produced about one and a half billion gallons of wine. Whether connoisseurs can raise a glass to this year's harvest may depend on what Mother Nature has in mind in the coming months. In London, Terry Okita, CBS 4 News. Last year, Italian wine sales topped $12 billion. Italy's agricultural lobby predicts the country will still be the world's biggest producer of wine because rivals France and Spain have also had some pretty bad weather.